Welcome back to another episode of the Bear Trap on the Boom Bus Channel, Bears Podcast by a Bears fan. I'm your host, Terry, talking about our sixth round pick, Kylie Fitz out of Utah. Yes, sixth round pick, and I'm taking another risk because once again, Bears could trade, get back on the uh, clock, and I'll, you know, whatever. But anyway, Kylie Fitz, another senior bowl special, a uh, guy that I did not get to on tape, but he has some tape out there, so if you want to go watch uh some of his games but uh, i did I actually did watch one tape i just didn't write a report for him um but i did see him at the senior bowl where he did get to play some outside linebacker do a little bit of drills uh for that position kylie fitz i think if you like um our <laughs> fourth round pick oh i'm already joel i yeah ea I'm not even gonna, <laughs> I know how to pronounce, I have to look at it. But anyway, if you like our uh, fourth round pick, Joel out of West Kentucky, if you like his tape, you really gonna like Kylie Fitz tape as well. Um, Utah, those guys are really active. They play really hard on that front. Uh, they've been kind of known for that for the past few years since the coach took over. So, um, that's a guy that I already expected to really see a hard worker, you know, a high character guy. Uh, very uh explosive in the short area. He played it with his hand in the ground, so you know he has that uh, toughness on the edge. But this is a guy that is uh, 100% ready to stand up and be an outside uh, linebacker. Now, as far as a pass rusher, from the little bit that I saw, it's not... Uh, he's not a natural, uh, bender that's just gonna, uh, terrorize somebody on the edge, but he, uh, does play with strong hands and he plays with a good head. So I think, uh, him really getting in, uh, Fangio's camp, really learning how to, uh, hone his pass rush moves is gonna be good. But you're talking about sixth round, you get a guy with some really good movement skills. You get a guy that uh, has the body type that you want to really uh, build on that frame. And, you know, if we want to talk about some numbers, you can look at it. So he's about 6'4". Uh, arms aren't super, super long, uh, but still long enough to do what you want to do. And the one thing I think if you look at his combine that you might be real uh, impressed by is that he had a three cone that was under seven seconds uh, by a decent amount too. Now, seven seconds is kind of that mark where uh, you want an NFL player to be, but you're talking about a lot of linebackers, uh, like stack linebackers and some safeties that uh, don't hit that three cone mark as fast as he did. So that's just shows that short area change of direction, that explosiveness, Something that you really like there uh, with his 688. And then as far as the 40, he ran a 469, so right on 47. So again, not a speed demon or, you know, a pure uh, explosion uh, pass rush off the edge, but still somebody I think that's going to give you some good reps. Uh, he does remind me a little bit of Aaron Lynch with less athleticism, but I think between him and Aaron Lynch, if, uh, especially if Aaron Lynch is healthy, these are some guys that are really going to compete. And definitely uh, bring a lot of special teams to the group. Uh, of course, Lynch, somebody that Fangio's familiar with. So I think Kylie Fitz, uh, now it's going to sound like a, a pun, but Kylie Fitz, I think he fits well in with the uh, rest of the crew that we got. So while, again, like I said, the edge rushers weren't top tier this year, this is kind of a really good football character guy that you can get. Uh, with a low cost like a six round pick and have some decent upside so go to the comment section let me know what you think about the pick thumbs up subscribe share it around to get this conversation started who do you want for that last pick or other positions you might want go down and share remember stay up and bear down